In this program, we're going to learn about mammals. A mammal is an animal that has fur or hair and is fed milk from its mother's body. Mammals live in different habitats all over the world. A habitat is a place where an animal can find the food, water, and shelter it needs to live. Some mammals, like camels, live in dry deserts and can go long periods of time without water. Some mammals, like monkeys, live in rainforests. Monkeys find shelter in trees. Other mammals, like polar bears, can live on the frozen tundra. The polar bear has fur to keep its body warm. Buffaloes are mammals that live on grasslands where they run wild and feed off the plentiful grass and small plants that grow there. Some mammals, like whales, live in water habitats. Whales are mammals that must come to the surface of the water to breathe. Humans are mammals too. Humans live in different habitats all over the world. Mammals have different characteristics than other animals. For example, all mammals, like this elephant, have backbones. giraffes, squirrels, and humans have backbones too. Some animals like starfish, worms, and spiders do not have backbones. They are not mammals. All mammals are warm-blooded which means they can control their body temperature. Zebras, skunks, and cows are all warm-blooded. Some animals, like alligators and snakes, are not warm-blooded. Their body temperature is controlled by how hot or cold it is outside. They are not mammals. All mammals have hair or fur. Polar bears, lions, and sheep are covered in different kinds of hair or fur, and they are all mammals. Birds are animals covered with feathers. They do not have hair or fur. Birds are not mammals either. All mammals have lungs and need air to breathe. Fish are animals that don't have lungs. They have gills to breathe underwater. Fish are not mammals. Another big difference between mammals and other types of animals is that mammals have mammary glands. Mammals use their mammary glands to produce milk that is used to feed their young. Now that you better understand mammals and their characteristics, here's something to think about. Why do different mammals have different colored fur or hair? Think about it. 